and welcome to the video. So if you're anything like me, you're running into the same problem I was when you're trying to transfer your phone videos and pictures off of your phone onto your desktop computer, getting a system device uh, not responding, usually right at the end of the transfer of all the files. Um, I was getting it running into that and it became very frustrating. I like to take videos uh, for a small vlog that we have and uh, generally the only camera I have on me is my phone and it became very frustrating um, to do that because um, when I would try to transfer, especially larger files, so small video clips, maybe 30 seconds or less, they seem to transfer okay. Um, larger videos, maybe anything over that, um, I would try to do them one at a time thinking that maybe it was a corrupted file or something like that. Um, sometimes it worked, sometimes it didn't, uh, but generally it would fail. And the process that I ended up going with was I would just upload my videos from my phone to a cloud and then once uh, it would get to the cloud it would have to process before I could download them again and when I would download them back to my computer unfortunately it wasn't at the quality that the phone originally took it was degraded so the video wasn't as good as it could be which was kind of frustrating so went online went did some research and lo and behold came across a quick and easy fix uh, for you and I to go and get our phones uh, being able to download the videos and pictures all that we want No hassle. It's actually a quick easy fix uh, Watch my steps here, and I'll show you how to do it What I'm going to show you is what happens when you get that error message originally. So these are the default settings that are on your iPhone. So I'm going to try to copy over. I've got a whole bunch of just random videos and pictures on my phone. I'm going to try to copy them all over. Uh, we'll see the error message that pops up. And then what we'll do is we'll disconnect the phone. We'll reconnect it after changing one quick setting in the general settings on the iPhone. Change that. Bob's your uncle. Uh, you can download all the pictures and videos that you want from your phone. So um, here's the steps. All right, so here we are. We're just in my computer. We're going into the iPhone here into one of the video folders. So I'm just grabbing, like I said, it's all random pictures and videos that I had on my phone. So we're going to copy these over just to a temporary folder on my hard drive. And uh, this process takes a while, so I've sped it up. Um, it's like 10 times speed, so it's gonna go through here. It's just about getting ready to fail. So there you go, we got our error message. So we're gonna click OK to that. Uh, we'll check the downloads folder, see how many of the videos actually copied over. Kinda give it, didn't, didn't actually count them all, but if you take a look, so you can see about two thirds maybe gotten copied over so we're gonna wipe all of these out and then we are going to um, change the settings on the phone so you're gonna go into your settings you're looking for photos and uh, once you get into photos here you're gonna scroll all the way down to the bottom and you're gonna see transfer to Mac PC it's gonna be set to automatic you want to set it to keep originals and then just back all the way out to the, your main phone and then just hook your phone back up to your computer and uh, now we're gonna copy those same uh, folder or videos over the there's an extra one there that was actually the video that I took of uh, settings on the phone so we're just gonna copy these over now this is in real time as you can tell there's a big difference uh, copying the files over and that's it so it's all copied over, no error messages. So we're gonna go in the downloads folder. I'll try one of the videos that I took that night. We had some rain. So I ended up taking a video outside of some rain because it's pretty rare out here in Phoenix. So there we go, got some rain. So the, all the video copied uh, its original format. So it looks pretty good. So there you go.